It's Tiny Tuesday. Today is the day that we get to step our mini savings challenges. I am so excited. Let's get into this video. Hello everyone, welcome and welcome back to my channel, The Almost Organized Hour, where we are on a mission to get organized in our finances through budgeting, cash stepping, and saving challenges. If that is something that interests you, please stick around. How is everyone doing? How are you feeling? How is your week shaping up? Let me know in the comment section. All right, so let's go ahead and see how much we are going to save today. We have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, and 40. We have $40 that we get to put towards our Tiny Tuesday binder today. And that is because my husband has been working like a crazy person um, between his job job and his side hustle. So <clears throat> we have some extra funds to put towards our savings challenges. And I'm excited about it. Normally, I would start off with the savings challenge in the front. But we are going to go and grab Sam's challenge towards the back just to make sure that we have enough funds to cover it. I don't know if there are some hefty numbers in here. So I just want to take care of this first. No IOUs today. Let's go here. All right. So we have five and five. So that's 10. Just when we have a little extra money, we end up having um, those low numbers. So I wonder what those other scratch off amounts are going to be, but that's okay. We'll find out later. We Now we just have extra money to put towards our other savings challenges. So that's a good thing. All right. So let's go back up towards the front and start from the beginning. This first savings challenge is from Lemon Ivy, and we are putting in $6 towards this one today. So $6 for this one. All right, and so I have some exciting news for you guys. I am so happy to share with you some work updates and some car updates. And I really like doing those sorts of things on the Tiny Tuesday video because these are tend to be shorter and a little more laid back than the regular savings challenge videos. I'm going to scratch this savings challenge from Rami over at Budget Paparazzi and chat with you guys a bit. Um, many of you know that we were saving for a car and emphasizing the words, the word were right? We were saving for a car because we have saved for our car. <laughs> and I am super excited about that. You guys, um, I started working in August of last year of 2023. And um, we were putting those funds. Um, initially, when I first started working, um, we were only moving over a little, um, little of those funds at a time. Uh, to put towards the car savings. We had some other things that we needed to take care of, some other bills and things. You guys hear the birds chirping. It's starting to be uh, get closer to spring, and so our birds are singing. Um, anyway, um, but then around, I would say, October, November, um, we looked up and we were like, okay, we really need to get serious about saving for this car and try to bank as much of that paycheck as we possibly can. And so that's essentially what we did. And you guys, I'm going to scratch one more for, on this one. And you guys, we did it. We were able to pull together about $7,000 to put towards purchasing a car. And when I tell you, I was elated. I don't think we've ever saved that much money that quickly before, ever. <laughs> okay, so I put in the funds for Rami's challenge, but you all didn't see that. And um, then I pulled out Oma Crafts and Budget Savings Challenge under his wing. You 
Under his wings you will find refuge, Psalms 91 and 4. I scratched a 5, and so I'm going to go ahead and put that in here. And what I was um, letting you guys know is that um, with that $7,000, my husband was able to locate a vehicle just like a commuter car that we could use to get, you know, back and forth. And it was wonderful because the car was only $5,000. Um, and he uh, recognized that we wanted to have um, save some of the funds that we did save up um, to put towards maintenance and that sort of thing and helping us out with um, paying down some of our debt and going towards our financial goals. And so that worked out wonderful. Um, it was just like a little commuter car, something that we could use um, to get back and forth from work, something that was good on gas. And so that's what he was able to use. Um, that's what he was able to purchase. So you guys, it is official. We have a second car. Oh my gosh, it's so exciting. So grateful and blessed to be able to be in this position to finally have this second car. It's such a huge relief and burden um, lifted because the commute was honestly very taxing and challenging, but we made it work for the last 10 plus years. And I'm grateful to God that he saw us through those times. Um, and now we have this second car and it has, it is just such a blessing. <laughs> um, also, I already filled in these two and put the funds here. And this savings challenge is from Ren over a mischief managed budgets. Okay. And then I had Pace of Grace and I put in $2 for the F. And so that just leaves us with one, two, three, four, and five dollars remaining. And I'm going to go back up to the Owl Savings Challenge from Lemon Ivy and put in three more dollars. So, yes. Yeah, so, I mean, I'm just, I'm really grateful to all of you all in the cash stuffing community who have encouraged us and um, just you know, left scriptures in the comment section who has just really been there to help cheer us on. And I am truly appreciative of, of your support. And I'm grateful now that we actually had this second car and we did not have to take out a loan for it. Oh my goodness. It's such a good feeling. So I'm going to go ahead and put in $3 into this one. So we have one, two, and three. Oh, and you're probably wondering, where is Tiny? <laughs> well, I should have said something at the beginning, but I was so excited to share with you guys our car news um, and our, our savings in such a short period of time. So it slipped my mind. <laughs> all right. So with Tiny, thank you all so very much for your incredible support of Tiny and her savings challenge. She is just blown away by the incredible support that you all provided to her. I get an Etsy payout monthly, and so I have not received those funds as of yet, but I should have it by Friday. And so that way, um, Tiny can record with me and we can post our Tiny Tuesday video so she can share with you um, her wonderful progress in her savings journey because of all of you guys. And so I am so grateful for you guys purchasing her challenge, reposting her challenge, putting it in your community posts or telling people about it in your videos. I am so grateful to you guys. I really, really appreciate that. And Tiny does too. Um, this community is absolutely amazing never seen anything like it in a virtual world right so this is so amazing i, I truly appreciate you guys so we have two dollars that we're putting towards this savings challenge and this is from jesse over at jesse budgets all right so as for work because i was originally working primarily to save up for our car um, because we have reached the goal of saving for the car and purchased the car, um, I was originally on a six month assignment. And so, um, technically that assignment has ended. However, my supervisor wanted to keep me on a little longer because we're working on a project. Um, so I am still with the company, but just on a kind of like a project basis. So my hours are not um, are not the same as they were before. It's a little bit reduced, which is totally fine by me because I was working like a crazy person. <laughs> um, but I am grateful for the opportunity to still have employment and we can use those funds to help us towards our financial goals 
And so I am grateful for that. Um, stay tuned for a debt update, you guys. I am excited about that as well. Um, we are really making strides to try to get rid of um, some of this consumer debt that we have. And the motivation comes from watching your videos or um, reading your comments and that sort of thing. And so I, I greatly appreciate it. Oh, also, I have a new savings challenge in the shop. I did a community post about it. Um, and I think that they are really pretty and um, they are about love. You know, sometimes um, parents' days can be tough uh, when you have lost a parent. Um, Mother's Day, Father's Day, um, when we celebrate our grandparents. Um, but I think that these Savings challenges are great for if you have these parents, if you don't have these parents, if you have parents, um, people in your life who are like these parents, or if you just want to save in memory of your parents. Um, I think that this would be, these savings challenges are great for those. We have a mother's love, a grandparent's love, and a father's love. And then I also have a printable called Someone's Special Love. And it is so adorable, you guys, even if I, <laughs> I think it's so pretty. Um, and that's available on my Ko-Fi site as well as, um, as well as Etsy. And these come in one, uh, an A5 size as well as the A6 size. The A5 size are the larger envelopes and they fit right down in here just like this. And this is a zipless one, but typically um, it'll have a zipper on it and they fit there. Or you have the A6 size and um, they fit inside the A6 envelopes like this. Now the A6 size um, challenges, they do have different scratch off stickers just because the larger stickers just to me didn't look right on the smaller challenges. So we have the smaller stickers for the A6 and they come in the traditional color. So that's the silver and the gold. So we have gold for the grandparents and then silver for the parents. And these are the A6 size challenges. So I hope you guys like these. I am working on some other products um, to help grow my shop and to um, just put some more products out there for you guys. Uh, and I am really excited about all the things that are on the horizon. And I hope that you all like these here. I also have a um, self-care savings challenge printable that is both in the Etsy shop and in the Ko-Fi site. So I wanted to make sure that I had a savings challenge in both English and in Spanish. And um, that is this uh, prayer and self-care savings challenge. All right. Thank you all so very much for being here. I truly appreciate you guys. I am so excited about all of the wonderful things that are happening, um, the financial goals that we are achieving, and I am just oh so grateful to each and every one of you for being here on this journey with us. Thank you again for your support of Tiny. We really appreciate that as well. And if you all have not done so already, please feel free to go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit the notification bell so that you can be notified the next time that I upload a video. And remember, you guys, that tiny amounts grow to big savings. So keep saving. And until next time, bye.